The yeah, people who is. still believe that he is. got, you know, <laughs> somehow. Whoopi Goldberg has officially apologized after using a Romani slur on The View. The moderator offended a whole bunch of people during the March 15th episode of the ABC talk show when she said a word commonly used as an obscenity against people of Romani heritage, but she was quick to apologize. I should have thought about it a little longer before I said it, but I didn't. Let's get into her controversial comments and her apology. I'm Anna Rumor, and this is Pop Culture Social Call. Whoopi's comments came during a conversation about the 2020 presidential election. The people who still believe that he got, you know, <laughs> somehow in the election will still believe that he cared enough about his wife to pay the, that was gas, pay, <laughs> you know, to, to pay yeah. that money from his personal thing. People on Twitter immediately called her out for it, and it didn't even take until the next episode for Whoopi to offer an official apology on The View's Twitter account. Whoopi said she mistakenly used the word as it was something she had heard her whole life. You know, when you're a certain age, you use words that you know from when you were a kid or you remember saying, and that's what I did today, and I shouldn't have. I should have thought about it a little longer <laughs> before I said it, but I didn't. And I should have said cheated and I used another word, and I'm really, really sorry. Now, the View fans know this isn't the first time Whoopi's gotten in trouble for what she said. The moderator was briefly suspended for two weeks last year after making comments about the Holocaust, saying in January 2022, but she thought it was not about race. The Holocaust isn't about race. No. No, it's well, not about maybe race. Maybe it, it, yeah, no, it's 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 about, a, a different it, race. But it's, it's not about race. It's not about well, race. What is it about? Because you, it's about man's inhumanity to man. Now, Whoopi did apologize for that as well. I said something that I feel a responsibility for not leaving unexamined because my words upset so many people, which was never my intention, she said on the show. And I understand why now, and for that, I am deeply, deeply grateful because the information I got was really helpful and it helped me understand some different things. She also tweeted a statement in which she apologized for the hurt she'd caused. At the time, the Anti-Defamation League accepted Whoopi's apology in a statement, saying that they had always known her as someone who stands up for the Jewish community and that they hoped she would educate herself and use her important voice in our country to educate instead of harm. But then in December, in an interview with the Sunday Times, Whoopi doubled down on saying the Holocaust wasn't originally based on race, which ADL chief Jonathan Greenblatt called deeply offensive and incredibly disappointing. Whoopi then apologized once again, saying that it wasn't her intention to double down on those comments and that she does believe the Holocaust was about race. In this time of rising anti-Semitism, I want to be very clear when I say that I always stood with the Jewish people and always will, she told people at the time. My support for them has not wavered and never will. So what do you think about Whoopi's apology? Let me know in the comments, like and subscribe where you're there, and head over to popculture.com for the latest in entertainment news. Until next time, I'm Anna Rumor, and this is Pop Culture Social Call. <laughs>